birthday everyone, peace be with you. Welcome to our learning packet 2.5 about corporal works of mercy. Let's start with Proverbs chapter 28 verse 27. It says, Those who give to the poor will lack nothing, but those who close their eyes to them receive many curses. These are our learning outcomes as we discuss today's topic. First, to enumerate the corporal works of mercy. Second, to ask the Holy Spirit in prayer for the grace to put into actions the works of mercy. Our Benedictine value is work and our value focus is empathy or in Tagalog, pagdadamayan. It is the ability to identify with and understand another situations or feelings. In this lesson, we hope to imbue the value of empathy by responding to the needs of people, doing something to help the needy, like comforting those who are sorry, those who are in pain, and by being sensitive to the feelings of others. The corporal works of mercy are charitable actions by which we help our neighbors in their bodily needs. Remember, corpse means body. So these works of mercy, we are helping our brothers and sisters in need in their bodily needs as if they were Christ in disguise. Let us enumerate the corporal works of mercy. First, feed the hungry. Second, give drink to the thirsty. Third, shelter the homeless. Fourth, visit the sick six visit the, the prisoners or the imprisoned and last bury the dead remember there are seven corporal works of mercy and we help our brothers and sisters in their bodily needs i have listed some practical advice in our learning packets on how you can leave them out especially in our situation right now Delivery of milk tea or take, taking out of burgers, you may try to give it up and donate food to families who have no money to buy food. Make an effort not to waste water. Remember to turn off the water faucet when you are brushing your teeth or washing dishes can help. You can also give cold bottle of mineral water to the tired frontliners like those who are delivering foods and services at home.